name is Epic Asian. Today, I'm gonna talk about the never ending Singapore plot twist NOC Ryan vs Sylvia Part 3, featuring Xia Xue because she featured me in her movie trailer. This is Sylvia Chan. This is Ryan Tan. They are the co-founder of Night Out Cinematic, one of the biggest Singapore YouTube channel. This is Chicken Rice Uncle. This is NOC Avenger. A few weeks ago, the Chicken Rice Uncle released screenshot. Says Sylvia treat her employee bad bad. Sylvia says sorry on her Instagram. Sylvia says she will not appear in NOC video in the future. A few days ago, NOC Avenger make a blog post with Zoom video to show Sylvia as a bad bad manager. Today, Xia Xue released an exclusive video to let Sylvia tell her story. Wow, Xia Xue, your video food king long! Until Naima cannot recognize. Today, no need to sleep already. Why? You want to become Oprah Winfrey? Ah? This is what Xia Xue and Sylvia say. Know what I say? 10 years ago, Ryan and Sylvia start NOC. Before they divorce, Ryan's salary is always higher than Sylvia. After they divorce, Sylvia owned 51% of the company. Ryan owned 49% of the company. Even though Sylvia has 51% of the company, she cannot control the whole company because she is a CEO. Ryan is the director. CEO have to work for the director. After they divorce, Ryan and Sylvia arguing because Sylvia find out Ryan secretly go and make a new company, Rhino King. Ryan use NOC resource and money to promote Rhino King. Ryan take all the profit without Sylvia. Sylvia angry. Sylvia asks her lawyer to talk to Ryan lawyer. Oi, why you do this? I want to do my own thing. Hey bro, we are business partner. You are company director. You use NOC money, go build your new company. This is a breach of trust. I want Renault King to be under NOC. I don't want Renault King to be under NOC. I want to exit from NOC. You can take my 49% if you pay me. Sure bro, what's your price? I want millions of dollars. Oh, you crazy ah? If I give you that, NOC will bankrupt. I will be left with nothing. Suddenly, the NOC saga boom shakalaka. Chicken Rice Uncle show WhatsApp chat history. NOC Avenger show Zoom video recording. I don't know who is a Chicken Rice Uncle. Can you name some candidate? I don't know, but I think it could be Isabella. Is Isabella and Ryan dating when they go Taiwan? Based on my experience, maybe? But I have no evidence. Sylvia say within the first week of the drama, NOC company lost $250,000. Sylvia say she already stepped down as influencer. Sylvia don't understand why Chicken Rice Uncle and NOC Avenger want to keep destroy her. Sylvia think only Ryan has the most benefit when Sylvia is destroyed. Ayo, the video too long already. All over the place. Let me give you a summary of what Sylvia say. 11 years ago, Ryan and I married. One to two years later, Ryan cheated on me with a waitress in the restaurant that he opened. Then, Ryan repeated his behavior with some NOC girl. Best friend. He will send his best friend home at midnight, take them up from the club, and scold me when I scold NOC girl. I never say anything because I want to preserve our NOC golden couple branding. Ryan also said he wanna yeah. himself. I'm not trying to make fun of him. I sincerely want to protect him. But over time, I feel manipulated. I'm still worried if he see this video, he will do crazy things. I am a rude person. I admit. I go see therapists. I really want to change. I have never ever cheated on Ryan for a single time. The WhatsApp chat about the big and fat lollipop happened after we separated. We have separated since 2017. I didn't use the money to do my own things. The house I live in is also used for them to shoot video. It suits my lifestyle because I work and shoot video there. My brother has always been a talent and runner in NOC. He is working so hard. So why are we not paying him? Ryan always called my brother stupid. Ryan also like to record people secretly. In the Zoom video, they only show the terrible beat. I didn't make up, they also record me. I only asked some of my NOC girlfriend to follow me to party. I did not ask anyone to sleep with the rich boss. In fact, the girl also said that she enjoyed it. I was only drinking coconut juice in the kitchen. Long short story, the Ryan that you know in YouTube is different to the Ryan that I know in real life.
Moral of the story, who is right or wrong? I really don't know. Who is telling the truth? Nobody can tell you. He say one thing, she say one thing. Blame 来 blame 去, don't have good ending.